an initiative towards e-learning and for the outreach of students directorate of school education kashmir has introduced learning management system the application supports the entire learning spectrum including traditional face to face content delivery through recorded videos blended learning and virtual online curriculum delivery it brings both teachers and students together on one platform and will provide user friendly tools and resources now my dear colleagues my dear teachers how we will enter or update this lms and we have to add the faculty we have to add the students and we have to upload the necessary content to understand all this process let's open our browser maybe this is chrome okay let it be chrome so i am opening the browser now i have to enter the ip address to get the ip address that i have already received the uh, through the medium of various circulars issued from the uh, office so i will open any of the whatsapp groups on which this that has been disseminated now this is the uh, ip address so i will long press it now it says link copied now i will go into my browser chrome browser and i will long press here now comes the option paste i will tap on paste now you can see the url that i require has been entered here then i will i will tap on tick okay here i am this is learning management system platform okay now i need to log in to log in what uh, i have to do i have to enter the mobile number that has already the user id and passwords have already been provided to the uh, to the hois now in the username column i will enter for example i will enter a mobile number for instance it is 95 okay this is this and the password we need to enter the password here okay and i have already entered the password so i need not to type it again then i will tap on sign in here my dear teachers we are signed in and we have entered on in the uh, this learning management system platform okay now what i have to do i have to, for example i have to add a teacher how i will do that i will tap on the school option okay now here is the add program and add faculty i will tap on add faculty okay this is district ceo badgam zone narbal and school is this now if i have to enter any faculty name maybe this is a b c for instance okay then designation i will enter here whether he is now obviously he must be a teacher that so i will enter this general line teacher okay mobile number i will type here okay i will type it tap it again okay now i can enter the mobile number here like this okay this is for instance then nature of appointment is permanent i have nothing to do this with this a uh, faculty role i will tap on this this is faculty if it is hod principal headmaster zdo zrc okay i can do it now password here i have to enter the password for example uh, i have uh, typed the name i have entered the name of the faculty member as abc i will keep its password as abc123 to remember it okay then i will tap on this add faculty and in this way uh my this member will get add uh, this added to the this lms of my school okay then this was how to enter the, add the faculty then there is i will tap it again then there is school management okay i will tap on the school management and i will tap on add student now you can see i can easily add any student our district badgam school i will tap on this now the name of the school is here okay then class it's kindergarten no i will change it to first standard okay then stream name i will uh, tap on this and i will keep it as general 1 to 
then I have to enter the name of the student as for example this this is Aiza A A I Z A H Aiza Ajaz okay then mobile number now let me enter the mobile number here it is okay now here enrollment number I will how I will this uh, enter the enrollment number now you can see there is some code written I will just delete this and I will enter the UDIS code 01041602304 now this is 11 digit code okay I have to make it 14 digit 14 digit enrollment number is acceptable so I will add three more uh, digits now it is 11 already I have to make it 14 for example my this student Aiza Ajaz uh, she reads in class first I will write one okay this is class first and her enrollment number is roll number two say so I will uh, enter zero two okay and now it has become 14 digit and I have uh, generated an enrollment number with details as first 11 digits are it is uh, UDI score of the school then there is one that is the class of the student and then is uh, zero 02 that is the uh, roll number of the student okay then I have to create the password for the student and I will create it as A A I Z A H I Z A one two three okay I will add tap it add student now you can see my this student has been added Isa Ajaz with the mobile number this first standard enrollment number is this and now my dear uh, friends we can uh, just update the student here for example if I have made any error I have any made any mistake during the entry of the student I can simply tap on this update option and I can change anything any mobile number name enrollment number anything then I have to tap this update student in this way I can add the student I can update the student and the same way I can add any faculty member and I can update the faculty member so I think um, this is all about this how to um, enter the uh, how to in fact update the LMS with the teachers and students so I hope you must have understood this thanks for watching this video